welcome back everybody thrifty shelves here to do a dollar tree haul um actually my pajamas i want to do a pop um a pajama dollar tree haul um it's actually been raining this week so it's been a little bit cold and rainy and wet so i haven't been trying to shop too much but i did go to a couple dollar trees this week and so I found a couple good things here. So let's get it started in today's haul, shall we? And if you're new here, I do shopping hauls and reviews. And yeah, let's get into it. And also, like this video if you like watching Dollar Tree hauls. Uh, first item I found was I found this new item. It's called Put a Lid on It. Um, it's by Great Sense. Uh, it's pre-poo toilet spray and it's tropical tropical hibiscus so let's open it up and see what it smells like i don't normally um buy the little toilet sprays but mm, it was new so i thought i'd buy it oh yeah and everything in my haul today is a dollar 25 i'll get my scissors to open this There we go. So it was a tropical business spray. You're supposed to spray it in your toilet, but maybe I'll just spray it on here or something. Oh yeah, it smells pretty nice. Has a tropical scent for sure. It kind of reminds me of something. Oh yeah, it reminds me of something like uh, so, something in my childhood i don't know oh, like it's somebody's house or something i don't know very weird it smells pretty good and you get about 0 0.6 flow ounces in here that's kind of cute kind of leave it in the bathroom you know um then i found the beauty intuition mini lip balm set and if you haven't seen my last haul where I found a whole bunch of lip balms, like literally some flavored lip balms, I got this Dr. Pepper one in my last Dollar Tree haul. I'll add that up there in the sky if you haven't seen that one yet. But this one's so cute. I've been using it all week. I love it. And it definitely smells like Dr. Pepper. And it's really nice. I love it. And so, yeah, these ones are the by the Intuition, and it's a mini lip balm set. It's got sweet grape, grapefruit, um, fresh lime, and lemon sorbet. And it says it has coconut oil in these, so that's nice. And, yeah, let's just open them up because they're, I think I'm going to keep these ones myself. Um, I did see some other little sets, but I'll put the um, pictures probably on my Instagram, and my Instagram will be right here, or it'll be linked down in the description box, like always. Um, this one is Sweet Grapefruit. Let's see. Yeah, smells like grapefruit. Grapefruit's not really my favorite. So I don't know if I'm going to give this one to my friend or not. I don't know. I'll see if she likes grapefruit or not. This one's lemon sorbet. I love lemon stuff, so I'll use the lemon. Yeah, it smells lemony. Although I had Dr. Pepper on my lips, but... Pretty nice. I like it. And it's a lip balm, kind of like, I don't know, I kind of ripped the package, but it says it's a lip balm. Okay, and the other one is a fresh lime. And I'll smell this one and see if it smells good. Yeah, you can smell the lime. Oh, I think I got it on my nose. <laughs> But anyways, yeah, these smell really nice. 
And you can just like, you know, throw them in your purse. Um, keep them by your bedside table. Computer everywhere. I have lip balms everywhere. And if you can hear my cats running around crazily, I apologize. Like always, they're running around. <laughs> then I found this aroma 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 guru warming oil and it has a relaxed blend of essential oils um it says it has a scent of lavender fields with a hint of citrus and deeper notes and i got a couple of these ones for my dad because he likes to make candles and then put the oils um in it and i also got him a couple of the lavender but he already took those ones so I think I bought it in one of my last hauls, though, so you might be able to see what I, what they look like. Uh, next item here, same um, company. I kind of like it's different set, but these are lip oils. The other ones was lip balms, and these are lip oils. And it's by Beauty Intuition. And the flavor here is watermelon apple and peach i'm not gonna try these ones right now mm, yeah because i already to put something on my lips i could open it to smell it because i'm probably going to keep these ones yeah i'm probably going to keep them i don't know some of this stuff i give away i'm giving a giveaway with presents and then other stuff i like to keep for myself let's see I think I'll try the apple one just to smell it which one is apple is this one apple I don't know no that one's watermelon and here's what they look like up close So, yeah. Let me see which one's apple, though. That one's peach. That one's watermelon. Is this one apple? Yeah, this one's apple. So, let's see if it smells like it. Can't really smell it too much. I'll put it on my hand here. Comes out clear. You can smell a light, a bit of a light scent to it. So if you don't like strong scents, you'll probably like these. And it goes on pretty smooth. It's got a little bit of a sticky feel, but I think that's just because it's a lip oil rather than a lip balm. But yeah. I think that smells pretty good. It has a light scent to it. Maybe it's just the apple. Let me smell one of these other ones. Let's smell the watermelon. I love some watermelon. That one's clear as well. Yep, goes on the same. Oh yeah, the watermelon, you can definitely smell the watermelon. The apple one, you can barely smell it. I swear, I should always prep one of these um beauty wipes because i always get stuff on my hands when i'm doing these videos anyways next item here then i found the snickerdoodle flips now i didn't eat this and my hubby actually ate the whole thing but he liked them they're snickerdoodle flips I'm, like, not eating sugar, so, yeah, I didn't eat any of these. But, yeah, he said he liked them. So, if you like flips and you like snookerdoodle, you might want to check these out. Oh, and then the next item I got here is I found some Himalayan pink salt. I've never tried Himalayan pink salt. 
But I thought I'd give it a try, maybe. And this is by the Good Terra brand, and it says it's extra fine. Let me know down in the comments below if you leave, if you use pink Himalayan salt and if you've used this one, if it's good or not. I don't know. I thought I'd give it a try. Um, that's basically my only food items in today's haul, I think. Um, next item is I finally found the perfumes for the Spa Luxury. This one's the Cherry Blossom Scent. And it's a body mist. And the mister is really nice. And I love the smell of it. it smells really nice. Yeah, definitely nice. Um, so I got that one. They also had, I think, the Calvin Klein inspired one. I can't remember the name of that one. It says it's Calvin Klein inspired. And then they had the vanilla sugar scent. So I picked this one up. Um, I might give this one for a gift. I don't know. But yeah, it definitely smells nice. Smells like a nice true vanilla. Smells like a vanilla bean or a vanilla sugar cookie. It smells pretty good. Um, yeah. Then the next item here is I found that they have these sunflower scrub buddies. I was so excited. I didn't see that they had this, they, that they need these things. And good thing I went down the cleaning aisle because sometimes I don't even bother going down the cleaning aisle. But this time I did. And so I was very happy because I did need some more sponges. And I have a sunflower kitchen, so it for sure goes in my kitchen. So I got me three of them. The only ones that they had was these three. So I got all three of them. Um, yeah, this will last me for a little bit. Um, then I needed some containers because I keep, you know how some people like lose their socks and stuff? Well, we lose containers, container lids or containers in general. Or, you know, they crack a lot or they'll get broken or whatever. Then you got to toss them out. So, yeah, basically I just needed some more containers. And this one was a newer one because it has a new color lid. It's not showing up in the video, I don't think. It's a little bit dark here, but it's like a magenta pink. So I decided to pick that up. Um, this is a McCormick one. Um, last time I picked up the can't remember the other one that they sell there. I think it's like Betty Crocker or something. I can't remember, but those lids were not sturdy at all. It cracked like the first day that we had it. So I'm hoping these McCormick ones are a little bit more stronger. Otherwise, I might have to start buying my Tupperware from Walmart again, which I don't really care to buy them from there, but I might. I don't know. These ones are a little bit stronger, it seems like. Oh, not McCormick. I think it was Rubbermaid that was better. But yeah, maybe it is the McCormick that's not so, so strong. But this one seems a little bit stronger than the other lid that I had because it was like a really red and thin and it was flimsy. But this one seems stronger. I don't know. Let me know down below um what's your favorite um storage thing from there from Dollar Tree is. These ones seem pretty sturdy. Then I picked up these ones by Rubbermaid. And these were at Dollar Tree for $1.25. You get two in here. This one has three in here, and it comes like this, and this one's got two in there. So you could put like a sandwich or something in there or whatever. And my hubby takes his dinners, um, his meals to dinners for work, so yeah, I needed to get some of these. Um, then I had another restock purchase. I got some Brillo. I really like this stuff. Um, I almost like this. I kind of like the Ultra one, but I kind of like this one too. 
Um, this is the only one I seen there. I didn't see the ultra foam one there, but they did have the Brillo. So I decided to pick up the Brillo. Um, then I found this cute little cat toys. Um, they had four in here for $1.25. And so, yeah, I decided to pick them up. My cat, I think, heard them. <laughs> so, yeah, she, they like these little, um, pretty little iridescent ones. And then they got the balls in there. Um, then, I don't know if this is my last item. This might be my last item, yeah. Um, then I found the Wizards Naturals with Essential Oil, and it's a multi-purpose cleaner. I don't remember if I bought this one or not. I can't remember. I bought one of them. I think it was a lavender one, which I really liked that one. Um, this one's Rosemary and Cinnamon, and there's 13 flow ounces in here. And I love cinnamon anything, so I figured this would smell pretty good. Um, I don't know how well it cleans, though. I think I liked the last one that I used from Wizards, so hopefully it cleans pretty good. But anyways, let me know down your thoughts. Oh, I did get one more item, so don't go anywhere yet. I picked up these Clorox clothespins with no grips. Isn't that cool? You get, um... A 12 pack in here and they got the no grips so yeah that's clorox by name brand dollar 25 really good deal i don't hang my clothes up or anything but sometimes i like to have clothes strips to put um stuff on hangers and hang my clothes with so yeah and you never know someday you might need a Hang up your clothes if your dryer goes out or something. That's happened to me a couple of times, actually. So, yeah, I like having clothes pins around. And these are the Clorox ones. So, yeah, I think that was my last item there. So, thank you for watching tonight's video. Well, this might be in, in the nighttime. I don't know. Let me know down below in the comments if you like watching the video in the morning or in the evening. That will really help me out for when I decide to put out my video. Because the more people that watch it at a certain time, I think it... Oh, sorry. My cat just dropped something. Anyways, like, more people that watch it at a certain time, I think it helps out the video more to get more views at a certain time. But it also helps out when you give the video a like. So be sure to do that if you like watching my hauls. And thank you for watching today's video. Bye.